What is up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you're having a fantastic day. If you're new here, my name is Jeremy. And I'm Jillian. Why am I like looking at you and telling you my name? I know. If I'm, you're new I'm here, Jillian. hey, hi, nice to meet hi. you, Jillian. My yeah. name is Jeremy. I'm your wife. <laughs> oh, wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> so now that you know who we are, yeah. what's your name? Type it below. <laughs> Today is Warning Wednesday. Warning Wednesday. We just did the warning when they were 9, 12, and 14 years old, their cover of Enter Sandman by yeah. Metallica. And you know, I got the idea from Tim. Tim donated this song, which is the warnings version of Enter Sandman from Teatro Metropol in Mexico City. Thanks, Tim. Thanks, Tim. And he mentioned to us that their first video, the one that we just did when they were such little kids, they did for their grandparents. Yep. Post Posted it on YouTube, they go viral, and now fast forward, I don't know how many years later now this is from their first video, yeah. but a lot, right? Yeah, I mean, it's been some time, it's I, gonna I would be assume. fun seeing this version since we just did the kid version. Yeah, yeah. and this was from The Blacklist, uh, Metallica's 30th anniversary of the Black Album, I believe, and oh. they asked all these artists, 53 or something artists, to do a cover, and uh, The Warning was one of them. Interesting. But this isn't from that recording, this is from, like you said, the live performance. Yeah. So we're gonna see them rock out to the same song. If you missed the first version, go back and watch what we just did when they were little kids playing yeah. this song, and then you can maybe appreciate it just as much as we can seeing this new version, mm -hmm. how far they've come. I can't wait to check this out. Yeah. Before we get into it, make sure you guys hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and let's check it out. This is The Warning. Enter Sandman from Teatro Metropolitan. Here we go, ladies. Oh, this is gonna be so good. What do you think, babe? Oh, it's gonna be awesome. Yeah. Oh my gosh. This is different. And she's playing that Gibson, that oh. Explorer. Interesting. What? I wasn't expecting this Me at all. Okay. This is great. Beautiful. Gorgeous. Look at how the drums. What a cool remake. The harmonies! Oh, this is great. Oh. Oh, so pretty. Little backing track. But I saw Powell mouthing something. She does, she, she does that. Goosebumps. I love Ooh. this so much. <laughs> you hear Pow in the background? Yeah, I wish I heard Ali more. They sound great. Yes. It's just a piece under your bed. In your closet, in your head. It's a lie. It's a lie. 
Love that. I wasn't expecting the halftime. Yeah, Ali. I love Ali. I love when she gets like excited. Sing it. Oh, they brought the original there band. There you go. I like that they brought that back. Or into it. Ridiculous. Oh, that was awesome. I was not expecting that at all. Wow. That was ridiculous. What did you think? I wasn't expecting that at all. I, I didn't even know this version existed. The way I didn't that either. They, <laughs> they made it theirs, and how cool, instead of playing the same way that it normally is played, to make it their own. That it was amazing. I thought that was really cool. Yeah. For me, the vocals stood out more than anything. Really? Like the song, like this, for me, the song itself was just okay. Really? I really liked the halftime part. Yeah, I, I think because maybe I was expecting like metal, you know, oh, and yeah. it was just, it was a little soft. Not that that, there's I not anything that. wrong with it. Mm -hmm. I really loved the halftime that they did. I really loved that a lot. Yeah. But for me, it was the vocals. Yeah. The harmonies. Beautiful. Were awesome. Yeah. I loved that. I mean, I, now I'm just being critical well, about it. Like the yeah. song was good. You I know mean, what I mean? I mean, people come here because you're an audio engineer and they like to hear your perspective on things. Doesn't mean that you don't love it. It's just yeah. that you picked well, up. Well, this wasn't even about the audio engineering side. This is just about composition, own, yeah. songwriting type, you know, gotcha. like. It was good. It just like for such an energetic song, I was expecting energy and it didn't have a lot of energy, but it had vibe. It had feeling and it had emotion to it, you it's know. It's so funny how people hear things differently yeah. because I thought it was very energetic, yet ah. I see what you're coming from. You know, so it's just how we hear things differently. Yeah. It's not good or bad. And 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 the funny thing is probably my favorite part was probably the least energetic, which was the halftime yeah. chorus. Okay. So it's kind of weird. Like I feel like it wasn't very energetic, but my favorite part was the part that was the least energetic. Slow, yeah. <laughs> like I don't know. I just love that when they half timed it, and it, you can just um, yeah, and you just get down like that. <laughs> but then they had the two part harmonies, and then they ended up having the three part harmonies. I was I like I still it's wish so that they would boost up Ale. I know that she isn't comfortable yeah. and she likes to be lower. She sounded in the mix, great, but I I thought she sounded amazing. I wanted to hear her more. And what I loved too was when when you heard. Heard Ale and Danny singing that part towards the end. Yeah, they were doing the harmonies, and Ale was real quiet, but you still heard her over on the left, and I'm it sounded struggling. beautiful. Really? But I, I'm assuming it was Pow. We didn't see her during that point, but there was that high pitch ah, in the background, like way in the background, and that's when I said, "Oh, you hear Pow?" I think it was Pow. It could have been backing tracks. It doesn't matter because they no. probably record the backing tracks themselves. Oh, yeah, anyways. Yeah. I mean, everybody uses backing it's, tracks. It's always it's, them. Yeah. But I loved that. I loved how Danny and Ale did their their front thing, yep. and then Pow was way in the back with that high pitch. Oh. See, I thought I saw, and this is very common. Pow mouths as she sings. Like yeah. she may she may either whisper or just mouth it. But I think it was a backing track only because I saw her mouth Didn't the matter. first or two, but then she stopped. Yep. Not that it matters. It's just more like I caught something like that too. Yeah. Like I I, I thought it was Pow singing. And then she she mouthed something in a different way, yeah. but the the backing track was still going yeah. in like holding a note, and I was like, okay, so there's definitely backing tracks, but I mean, there's nothing. Yeah, wrong no, with it's no, it's just kind of like I don't care it about that. I like I love that. I just, I mean, kind of going back to the video we did right before when they were kids doing this song, the original version. Besides the fact that they're kids, they're kids that are singing and playing a song in a different language that is their native language. I mean, there's just so much mind blowing about them. Yeah, I they love are learning some talented them. people. Yeah, talented, talented. And uh, I think we got to set up an interview. 
um, business yeah, manager that's over the here. Fun. Yeah, okay, that's my role, and I am on it. Don't we gotta, we gotta talk to these ladies because they I are said, don't awesome. Don't you warn? Don't you warn? I'm <laughs> don't warning you. Worry. you. <laughs> but yeah, I, I love them, and they're amazing, and they seem like such cool people, yeah. and like they seem sweet girls, down to earth. I mean, I don't know them, but they just seem like easy and fun and yeah. just cool people, you know, so I'd love to talk with them. Yeah, a little preview for you guys. I don't even think that he knows this, but we got a donation request for Danny's recent video running through her oh, gear. I do know that. A lot of people have been recommending that, so I'm only kind of... PRSs. I'm only plugging it because so many of you said you have to do it. We're going to do it. That's going to be coming soon, and I think you're really going to dig it. I'm definitely going to dig it. Yeah. I just want to see all those PRSs. Yeah. That's all I want to see. All right. Well, the <laughs> no, Gibson I, I people see. want to see a, their uh, Lizzie Hale Gibson, too. Uh, yeah, I mean, Gibson, Gibson. We don't We don't need to get into that right <laughs> We now. don't we'll, need to we'll get into that. We'll save that for that video. I'm not hating on Gibson. Gibson's great. But okay, good. It's not PRS. All right, guys. Thanks for being here with us. <laughs> Thank you very much, Tim, for your donation. Really yeah. appreciate it. This was so much fun yeah. to watch. Like, I, it just blew me away. It was very different than what I expected. Totally. But in a good way. Mm -hmm. Like, this was cool. So... We're going to get out of here, and I know we're going to have another Warning Wednesday for you guys coming up soon. Mm -hmm. Just stand by. But in the meantime, if you like this video, hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you all soon, my friends. Peace! Peace.